bottom line is very, it's about, it's about doing what you need to to survive when the time comes to do so. And it always follows all of that sense of dread. <laughs> what genre? Metal. Influences from thrash to gore, sludge. There's even some of us that listen to Southern Rock. A little hip hop thrown in there sometimes, you know. Players should expect energy, a lot of energy. It's not going to change whether there's one person there or 100,000 people there. We always, we yeah. always bring that energy. Same, yeah. I will get up in your face. Me and Perry will get down in the crowd. If there's not a mosh pit, we'll start one. It's just, it's just the energy we've always had. It's not going to change whether there's one person there or 100,000 people there. There's no greater feeling than getting up there and watching people just go wild and release their inhibitions and release their stresses. There's no greater feeling than that. So I'm in therapy. It's good, but it's a good way to get out the frustrations and. I feel like we're bringing back that raw metal sound that people miss. Way to get out the frustrations and of everyday life and bullshit. Me and Joe are uh, prior military and like dealing with PTSD, I believe. For us, it's like music is one of those things that help us kick that short, you know, for you know, for that 30, 45 minutes, whatever we have on stage. It's just that time to fucking release from the world. Things like Burn the Priest and Things like Goat Horror, you know, a lot, a, lot, a lot of things that came out in the 90s and early 2000s that just, you know, just blew people to hell. Anywhere we play, Kentucky, Tennessee, anywhere. And uh, people people said we don't, we don't sound like anybody else. I always put the music in a box. You can tell people are playing from the heart. Pantera, Don Day, you can tell he was playing what he, what he likes to listen If you don't like to listen to your own music, you're not doing right. It's nothing but a bunch of nerves and adrenaline. And then once I get on the stage, um, I just, it's like the other guys said, it's just a, a big release, you know, of anger and frustration and stress of everyday life. And, uh, you know, you can just be free while you're on the stage. And, you know, nothing else matters except that moment right there. Play on stage and be like, from the first note to the last note, it's just like fucking energy all the time. One of my favorite moments of being on stage, I'd say we were in Murfreesboro, we were still pretty, it was in our first year, Caleb was there, we played a show and it was the entire crowd had a pig going on. So it was, it was pretty fun watching everybody react to your music.